Hello and welcome to the Get Creative Podcast, the podcast for creatives by creatives. I'm Evan Schmidt, and my guest today is Jonathan LeCoque. He's the owner of Coat of Arms, a post-production video company based in Chicago, Illinois, and Helvetia, West Virginia. All right, if you're ready, let's go. Okay, so Jonathan, what is the most important lesson you've learned? <laughs> it's such a huge question. Um, well, I, I have thought about this quite a bit, and I try to find something that can apply to almost any industry, um, and it, that is the lesson of balance. Um, it's something my wife and I, and I think the entire team that we work with here at Coat of Arms, we're always searching for that mystical, perfect balance. And that applies to the work-life balance that can apply to the balance between, you know, creative ambitions internally with client goals and messaging. You know, I, I think anybody in our industry can likely relate to getting a brief, getting really excited about something, and then having to pare down your creative ambitions to some degree in order to keep your client happy or vice versa even you know maybe you had a script idea and uh, ultimately it wasn't the best route for your client and having to adjust um, you know I know like for us we've worked with some rather large clients and they tend to have very clear guidelines and standards and we very often get the initial request to do something unique and different. And then we'll sometimes fall very quickly back into, well, we have to make sure this matches everything else that we've done. So I, I think finding balance is a huge, huge thing to focus on in life. And over my time, just generally living as well as working, I have found that when I look back, some of my happiest moments are the moments where I have found that sense of balance. Um, from a work-life standpoint, you know that that's a rather big one for for me as well. You know, as a, as an owner of a company, um, you know, and my my co-owner is my wife. We have t twin girls, so you know there are are many things always pulling on us. Uh, time-wise, you know, mm -hmm. and it, it's it's definitely a challenge. I mean, it is a, a daily, hourly, weekly, monthly, yearly challenge to find balance between work and life. You know, we don't want to get caught up in just focusing on the girls and just focusing on work or just focusing on time off or what have you. So I think that's at least a general start to the biggest thing I've learned, which is ultimately that I'm happiest, we're happiest, we do our best work, people enjoy working with us the most when we're able to to find balance. So, yeah, and I mean, I guess I could say from our artists' perspective, um, they tend to enjoy working with us the most when we have our clear directives, we have, you know, we're organized and we're working well with our client, and, and that's almost a sense of balance. I, I don't think... I mean, I think in, in many environments, the extremes tend to get noticed, you know, whether that's a negative extreme, a positive extreme, a creative extreme, you know, whether it's on Vimeo, whether it's in the news, or even like, you know, the election cycle, which is very much on our mind right now here in the States, you know, mm -hmm. I think the extreme perspective tends to get noticed. But I think beyond just you know, having learned that balance is important, it's also that you have to strive for it, and that might be in listening to each other and listening to other perspectives or in the sake of our artists having a an open enough dialogue with them that they can feel comfortable saying, hey, there might be a better way to do this or, hey, I'm not comfortable with this or, you know, maybe the scope has adjusted, whatever it is, you know, just finding a an environment where balance can be can be found in in just about every every way. You know, I I don't want to say that you know um, from a moral perspective. You know, like there are definitely clear you know black and white stances that are important. You know, so it's not mm -hmm. like well, hey, 
you know, maybe I shouldn't steal or I should, but you know, what's the balance? Maybe stealing a little, <laughs> you know, that is definitely not what I'm saying. <laughs> right. Right. But yeah, so I think that's, you know, I've worked in the industry maybe 12 years professionally and, uh, I have roughly 35 years of life experience and, I think that has, if I'm going to pick one thing that can encompass a lot, it's, you know, shoot for balance, have the ambition of finding balance and having learned that the happiest moments, most graceful moments, sincerest moments tend to be in that sort of balanced area, whether it's life or work or somewhere in between. Well, very well put. So what are you working on right now? What are you excited about and where can people find you? Uh, well, um, uh, excited about a lot. I mean, I think <laughs> that's why the balance thing is so important, right? I, yeah. I get, as a business owner, it's really hard to say no. There's always something that we, we want to do. Um, but yeah, right now we're, we're actually behind my recording here. I have uh, Adobe Premiere open and I'm editing a short film on, uh, what it's like to live in the town that uh, our West Virginia office is in. Um, so working on that, and we have a feature-length version that we're going to be working on as well. That's really exciting, and I don't know. There's a lot of exciting things. You know, we've, we're working on a, a a video kind of explaining uh, what disruptive innovation is. We're working with Google on a project. I can't really say too much about now. Mm -hmm. There's yeah, I mean, there's tons of stuff and. Um, we're always excited about something. <laughs> I think, uh, in terms of, con you know, getting in touch or seeing our work, you can find us online. Uh, the website is coat of arms post.com. So, uh, a coat of arms, like your family crest and then post from the word post production or the beginning of post office. So coat of arms post.com. And, uh, we're on Twitter, we're on Facebook usually as facebook.com slash coat of arms post or twitter.com slash coat of arms post. So yeah, we're around and you're welcome to email us if you have questions. And actually we did, uh, the funny thing is we did write a blog article on finding that work life balance. And I think we did that maybe a year ago. So it just goes to show that it's, it tends to be, uh, at the forefront of our thoughts whenever we're able to take that step back, which is so important, you know? Yeah. We'll have to find that post and I'll put it in the show notes too. Sure. Yeah. That'd be great. Yeah. And if, if anybody has uh, suggestions or thoughts, you know, the whole reason for having the blog for us is to have an open forum and some conversation with uh, folks out there. So we're, we're always, we, we know that we don't do it the right way all the time, you know? So it's uh, always a learning experience. Well, Jonathan LeCoque, thank you for your time today. Yeah, thanks for having me, Evan. I appreciate it. And that's it for another episode of the Get Creative Podcast. You can find more information about this podcast at evanschmidt.com. I'm also on Twitter and LinkedIn. Feel free to connect. For more information about this episode's guest, just check out their links in the show notes. If you want to be a guest on a future show, send me an email. I'd be glad to have you. I'm Evan Schmidt. Thanks for listening. Now go get creative.